What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Pop Complex. It's time for another Pop Complex unboxing. Alright guys, once again, welcome back to the Pop Complex. Today we're doing another Jack Specific Super Mario action figure unboxing video. So we have the brand new um, end of 2020 figures from Jack Specific, the Super Mario line. We have the brand new Black Yoshi. And we have Lemmy Koopa, one of the Koopalings or Koopa Kids. So let's take a closer look at the packaging here on Black Yoshi. You can see him there, it's the typical Mario, Super Mario branded style packaging. Flip it over on the back. We've got a little bit of a Black Yoshi bio that you can pause and read. And we have pictures of the other figures in the wave. Of course, we have Lemmy Koopa here that we're gonna unbox. And we have reissues of Mario with a green one-up mushroom, a reissue of the four-inch Fire Luigi, and a reissue of the four-inch scale Shy Guy. Here's Lemmy Koopa, comes with his magic wand, same packaging style. And if you flip it over, we have a Lemmy Koopa bio that you can pause and read. And once again, the figures in this wave. So here we go, guys. Let's go ahead and get these out of the package and take a closer look. All right, here's Black Yoshi and Lemmy Koopa out of the packaging. So we'll take a closer look. So Black Yoshi does come with the black spotted egg accessory, um, just like all of the other colors of the Yoshis come with their respective color eggs as well. So here he is. He's just a straight repaint of the existing Yoshi figure that we have, only in black. And he does have white shoes as well. So since he is the same as the other Yoshis that we have, um, his articulation will be the same. He has head articulation that allows him to go. It looks like it's on a slight ball joint. So there is a little bit of back and forth um, posability as well as the side to side. So due to his design, you can't get much angular motion out of his head, but mostly side to side. Um, he does have a shoulder joint that allows his shoulder to go up and down, forward and back. Same with the other arm and his hips, his legs, where his hips are, are on a ball joint, so he can go forward and back, in and out as well. And there is no ankle swivel, just like the previous Yoshis. So that is, sums up the articulation for the four inch scale black Yoshi. There's a closer look at him overall. All right, now we'll take a look at Lemmy Koopa. Classic Lemmy with that multicolored spiked hair and his little ponytail, rat tail going on here. He does come with his signature magic wand accessory. Now, Lemmy Koopa's first appearance was in Super Mario Brothers 3 as one of the Koopalings or one of the Koopa Kids. And he also reappeared in Super Mario World along with the other Koopa Kids as well. Flip him around, you can see the detail on his orange shell. And he is a little bit smaller than the other Koopa kids as well, just like in the two and a half inch scale um, Lemmy Koopa figure that I did unbox in a previous video. So take a closer look. His head articulation, his head goes from side to side just a little bit, whatever his shell will allow. He does have a shoulder joint, so his shoulder can go up and down and his arm can go forward and back and he has a wrist swivel so he can go in and out with his wrist same with the other arm now as far as the leg articulation his hip is on a small ball joint so there is a little bit of in and out movement not much but it's mostly forward and back and he has an ankle articulation where he can swivel back and forth and up and down with his foot there at his ankle and his tail is slightly articulated so it can go up and down just a tiny little bit but that is little little lemmy koopa 
as far as his articulation goes. And just for a little fun and comparison with the other Yoshis, I'm gonna bring in some of the other Yoshis. There's Green Yoshi. Pink Yoshi. Blue Yoshi. And the four inch scale Yellow Yoshi. Now the only one, guys, that I currently don't have in the four inch scale as far as the Yoshis go now is the Red Yoshi. It was issued back under the Jack Specific World of Nintendo branding and packaging, I think around 2015. So it is a little bit older. Um, it commands some higher prices on the uh, on the aftermarket, um, such as eBay. Um, but I'm hoping since they're reissuing some of these older uh, World of Nintendo Mario figures under the new line, hopefully pretty soon we'll get a, a reissued Red Yoshi. Um, at retail price that would be that would be really awesome so here's our family now of multicolored Yoshi's and we'll bring Lemmy Koopa back in just for a little bit of quick fun as well we're gonna bring in the rest of the four inch scale Koopa kids that we currently have from Jack Specific so we have the four inch Iggy Koopa and we have the four inch scale Ludwig von Koopa. So guys, I hope Jack Specific gives us many more, many more great Super Mario figures and finish up the rest of the Koopa kids, the Koopalings. Um, I believe that Larry Koopa in the four inch scale is out there on the horizon, so we should be getting him pretty soon. Uh, but I'd love to get a Wendy O Koopa and a Roy Koopa definitely. And then there's also Morton Koopa Jr. So um, I really hope Jack Specific, if you're hearing this, please give us the rest of the Koopa Kids in the two and a half inch and the four inch line as well. So guys, if you like this video, hit that like button, please. It really helps the video, it really helps out the channel. Please subscribe to the Pop Complex so you don't miss any of my new uploads and hit that bell icon so you're notified anytime I upload a new video. You can also support the channel if you like what you're seeing here and like my other videos. Go to patreon.com forward slash the pop complex and support me there so the videos can just keep getting better and better and better. Guys, once again, thanks for watching. This was the Jack Specific Super Mario unboxing of Black Yoshi and Lemmy Koopa. Thanks.